Hello, my name is Barishan and this is my official list of the top 10 horror movie villains. <coughs> uh, number 10, Leatherface. Uh, he himself is a hillbilly who kills people with a chainsaw for self-defense. His backstory is inspired by real-life serial killer Ed Gein who butchered women, skinned them and wore their skin because they reminded him of his mother. Mm. Number 9 Lestat from Interview with the Vampire Many people would judge him as an, an, as an anti-hero if you look deeply into all the characters but generally he is a villain. He picked up Louis and gave him a new life he survived from almost being killed by Claudia and he ends the movie with an evil laugh. <laughs> I don't care what the critics say but Tom Cruise owned as the character. Okay. Number 8, Pinhead from Hellraiser. Described as being an extremely powerful being, he can summon hooks and chains to mutilate victims and tear them apart. He's highly resistant to damage and direct assault such as gunshots and futuristic energy weapons. He can create other Cenobites from from both the living and the dead. Number 7 Ghostface One of the more effective and iconic killers. Ghostface while parodying other films along with its own material he or she is always on a serious mission while making the others look like suspects, turning them crazy and killing them off. Is all the mission to get to Sydney in all the Scream movies. Number 6, Victor from Underworld. First I would like to apologise that in my music video for the top 10 horror movie villains I did mention that Victor was at number 6 but instead I showed Marcus so sorry about that um, so now let's get to the main subject Victor is is the leader of the vampires also known as death dealers in the underworld movie he is the most ruthless arrogant meanest and most evil vampire you'll ever see. He overthrew the actual leader of the vampires, Marcus. He killed his own daughter, forcing Lucy to watch, and he created the army of death dealers from his original army. Number five, Hannibal Lecter. You know, I never thought he was actually the main antagonist. I always thought he was helping the protagonist to track down the other actual villains like the Tooth Fairy or Buffalo Bill. Sure he was giving out creepy lines and judged as a psychopath but like Lestat he's more of an anti-hero than an actual villain. Number 4 Michael Myers. He is the incarnation of all evil also known as or basically pure evil and the boogeyman. John Carpenter described the point behind the film by saying that evil never dies because of the Michael Myers character. Number three, Freddy Krueger. He was originally a child murderer and a rapist but the parents tracked him down and burnt him in a boiler room. This caused Freddy to get his revenge back and haunt the teenagers in their dreams and slowly kill them off. Number 2 Jigsaw Some say Jigsaw is not a villain but I say that he is a villain. He makes people appreciate their lives more by making them go through death traps, psychological torture and also known as self-sacrifice. He's not like Freddy or Hannibal Lecter but 
he has his own beliefs. The story arc with Dr. Lawrence Gordon was just great and Tobin Bell is amazing as Jigsaw. Number one is Jason Voorhees from Friday the 13th. What makes him scary is that no matter how far you could run, he could still catch you because he was a zombie also known as the living dead. It's also that his mother was originally a brutal killer because she avenged him causing him to avenge her so it was kind of a family thing that's my opinion on my top 10 horror movie villains so I'll see you then like comment and subscribe uh, if you're feeling generous share as well see you then